Hi YouTube, Rob here again uh, with another Bible review. Uh, this time something that I just wanted to share with you. Uh, this is a Church Bible Publishers uh, large print Thompson chain reference Bible. Now this was in my local Christian bookshop and I think I paid £20 for it about a year and a bit ago probably. And it is a really, really quality Bible. Now there are a few reviews uh, out there on the internet of the Thompson chain reference system so we won't go into that but just to share with you the, the quality of this Bible it is really really nice. Uh, Church Bible Publishers based in America only produce the King James Version and and they but they really do a, a fabulous job. Uh, as you can see there this is uh, this is an ironed calf skin it's quite a uh, you see the texture in in the in the leather there. It's sort of every every Bible they produce is, is sort of unique. Uh, you have the you know the raised hubs on the side there, very sort of classy. And the Bible is just so supple. It's one of these Bibles that when you open, it sort of just uh, sort of flops open into your hand. It's sort of as you can see there. It's, I'm not even doing anything there. Just the weight of the paper. It just it is a lovely Bible to hold. The only problem is it is it's very very big. It probably wouldn't one you would you would want to carry around for any length of time because its size. You can see there it is it is a huge Bible, but it is a nice desktop Bible. Uh, the print is a good size you can preach from. Like I say, it's uh, with Church Bible Publishers. It has uh, a liner. I'm not sure whether that's a leather liner or a vinyl liner. I would sort of probably err on the side of it being a vinyl liner, but I, I, I don't really know. But it is really nice, really supple. If you want to do Bible yoga, you can do. It will just roll up and you can sort of, uh, it'll just flop back down again into its place. It's really, really nice. Like I say, edge lined, uh, quite a few pages of cardstock, and then you're into the Bible itself. And as you're probably familiar, many people are familiar with the Thompson Chain reference system. Uh, you've got all that in there. It's, it's a really, really nice Bible. Now I think um, Church Bible Publishers usually do their own book blocks, but in this case I think they couldn't. I think they had to get this book block from Kirkbride, and it's not without its problems. There are a few uh, pay places where the paper is sort of... I don't know if anybody's sort of familiar with Thompson Chain Reference Bible. You get these weird creases, sort of very, very thin creases. I'll try and find one. There's one in Matthew, I think around about Matthew 25. And it's it's a bizarre thing. It's not really noticeable, but uh, it's just something to be aware of. And I think this is not Church Bible Publishers' problem, but I think it is... Uh, I don't know if you can see that there. Yeah, you can just make it out. Look, you see where the page is creased? And I've had a few sort of Thompson Chain Reference Bibles where that has, that has occurred. Uh, but yeah, it's it doesn't take away. I mean, for the price I paid for this, I'm not going to complain. Uh, it, it is really a nice Bible. And I think that's probably Kirkbride's uh, problem rather than rather than Church Bible Publishers. Uh, so there's a few things in there, but like I say, on the whole, this is really a really really nice Bible. And now getting hold of these, like I say, in the UK, uh, it's sort of hard. You have to send away to the uh, to the US. As last time I, I knew, I don't know whether Church Bible Publishers actually uh, ship um, internationally. I know the guy who works at, who set up Church Bible Publishers worked uh, with uh, local Church Bible Publishers, and I know that they didn't use to ship internationally at one time, and that may have changed now. But I do know that you can, you used to be able to get these uh, from the KJV store which is an American company so check out the internet on that one and they do ship internationally now Church Bible Publishers only do sort of limited sort of runs of different things so I'm not even sure whether this particular copy of the the Thompson is available anymore uh, they do sporadically uh, reissue these things but it might be worth checking out uh, like I say it is a lovely Bible you can see the sort of leather uh, leather Bibles and you're a Bible geek like myself I mean this is this is really really nice and I think to buy these new compared to some of the 
the the higher end sort of premium Bibles. These are a, sort of a fraction of the price. Uh, so yeah, do check the Church Bible Publishers out. Uh, and but yeah, I hope this has been a an interesting video to you. Like I say, uh, but check out your also your your local Christian bookshops, the second hand sections, your charity shops, because you never know what you're going to find. And I found a real gem in this. So I hope this has been interesting, and we will. Be back soon with another another Bible or book review. And until then, God bless you and we'll see you soon.